Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Marmoset, and welcome back to City Skylines and Amelia with our Let's Play. So, we've got a load of buildings that don't apparently have any power because, you know, power lines don't quite connect up in a completely perfect way. Just tag that in. Tag that in. Just try and get a little bit of connect connectivity amongst all this lot. Put these big parks in place, we should try and make use of them as best we can. Let's just stick across there. So people are beginning to move in. We don't have a great deal of demand. I always knew this was going to be a partial problem with Greater Elwoods because I was endeavouring to try and drive the demand. Let's just make sure we've got as much of this little lot is connected up as possible. Really? Maybe just stage like that across the top of there. I mean, the dinging noises of things leveling up and being generally happy. Really? Fine. Alright, okay, so nothing now doesn't have any power over there. All those little bits of fractured and broken power lines. Oh, no, we missed a spot. And apparently we've got people beginning to use this. So it works on some kind of level. Awful lot of buses, police cars, and other bits of traffic. Interesting. Alright, that's loads the buses. So where, my friend, are you going? You're going... to there. Okay, so you're shortcutting. Where is it you came from? Do it then. Or one of the industrial areas. So one of the things we may have to worry about apparently we don't have any power. Eight. Yeah. It's uh, slightly embarrassing. Uh, hmm. Yes, that is it. Right. I'd rather have a park than anything else. Right, grand. Setting, setting, done. Right. What are you? Oh, you're a school. Done. Right, so people will slowly but surely eventually look at moving in. In the interim, that power signal is probably going to annoy me. So, uh, balls. There we go, fine. Right, worry about that later. In the interim, I wanted to have a look at this little mess. This epic, epic mess. So, I'll be back after I've done a large amount of deleting. And we're back! Right, now, this is the first bit I want to look at. We are going to put one of our diverging diamonds in over here. So let's grab a one-way road. Actually, we can probably get away with the cheapest one. Straight up so at the moment that is the left hand side is coming out so we want a right hand side road going that way and we want a left hand side road going that way now previously we learnt that the best way to do it is to have that one come down as fast as we can and then come back up have you really I'm going to be annoying. Space already occupied. So we might be having to make these two slightly further apart than we have with previous ones, because we're trying to fit this junction in. Oh, that's the wrong way. That's the way I wanted to go. You need to come down to ground level. Apparently I need to bring you out just a little bit more. And then you need to come down to ground level. And come back. 
you need to connect to here. That's too close. Well, I think we can probably afford to trim just a little bit there. Let's get our curve on, shall we? Straight road. Change your direction. So you need to go from there to there. You there to there. Then change direction. So that's got straight ons. That's fine. Traffic presidents. Change lane arrows here. No left turns. Left to left, right to right, have the flip. Then grab you. So you are that side, so that way. Oops, not quite. Let me make sure we've got the space to turn these guys around. So let's have you. Down to ground level as soon as you can. Connect. Connect. You pop across there and then connect. And then we need to reverse the direction. You. Traffic residents, change lane arrows. There, no left turns. So now we've got a quite a hideous switch. And now we need to put our slip roads in. So if you're coming from. That's an upgrade. Let's get back to here. Or this one, probably. So if you're coming from here, to that road. Come back to about there. Then you are going to want to... Go around to that junction. Go around to that junction. Nice. If you are departing from here to a road, should we possibly can? We're going to want to be going to there. And we want to be going or push deep. Push deep. Let's uh, have to run these ones backward actually. Wow, we have to go quite far back for you. Don't really want to peel off the bridge. So the game doesn't like it when you peel off the bridge. Right, so we get to there. And we can get to there. So can we slope too steep? We just have to have a single lane there. That's okay. <laughs> it's just bus in the air. What's this? This is an air bus. It's like a normal bus, but you fly through the air in a terrifying manner. You are going to depart and go that way. Hmm. Oh, yes, and that way. In, and then, yes, this is the junction from here, wasn't it? I'm entirely aware that this junction is messy as hell right now. Wow. Um, I think what I need to do is probably start again. Well, yeah, that's not worked. Um, have you even seen this one not work? I'll be back in a sec with one that hopefully does. And I'm back, and I think this might work. Actually, I can't unpause. Um, 
bus routing things to worry about in a bit, where the buses will hopefully sort themselves out, because they've got, they've got to try and find some way of turning around amongst all this. Um, yeah, I'm not immediately concerned. Yeah, apparently they can do a swing around there, because I've left one of the road signs, or the road lines, slightly off. The gold line is just heading up onto the motorway, that's fine. So, traffic president, change lane arrows. I wonder... Vehicle restrictions. So technically, that lane there is bus only. Well, um, no, that won't work. That won't work. Vehicle restrictions. You can all do that. Change lane arrows. You can't turn that way. Right. Okay, so that's that sort out. Now, the next big chunk is going to be fixing this. So, what we do know we need is a road that comes in and a road that comes out. So, that looks like the road I was having coming in. So, looks like I had it elevated in some way, shape, or form. This is going to be tricky. There we go. So, that's the road in. And that's probably where I have the road coming. Out. Right, okay, so we are going to basically do what we've done previously, is just put a highway version of this really complicated structure in. Before I do that, what are you? You're a taxi depot, depot with no road access. Well, now you've got road access. I'm not too concerned with this, but I will see if I can get these guys plugged into the main network. Right, so let's make this a road network worthy of the name. So this is the road we're not going to touch, this is the road we're going to switch over. So, in that case, we've got it across the canal, we need to switch these guys over. So, you're the road out, switch you on to manual mode. Hmm, it's always going to have the road underneath the other one that switches. Well, let's try it this way first. Yeah, I think it is. It is actually going to be easier to have it as the road underneath that's switched. Substantially so. So let's get... Let's leave you elevated for now. A little earlier there, I'm afraid. Just have that one go back the other way. Then you can come down. Just push the switch button. Right, so that's that done. So now what we want to do is rearrange this road under here. Possibly doing a dive, possibly not. So Let's get deleting. Right. So, you guys, because of the nature of the canal, I can't have duck. So, what I'm going to do is have one of you guys. So, you are the road that comes in. Come over here. Go around and come back. Whereas you are going to double fly. 
let's uh, stick with the curvings. Get the double fly over to here, yes I can. So come over to there. And across to here, and now we'll need to delete a fair chunk of that. We head back down to ground level. Let's go for about here ish. I don't know how the funny games are always trying to connect these things up. Alright, so that's pretty enormous, but it is a very important junction, so I'm pretty happy with that. Let's see, right. We're going this way. We want to... I am just going to move this park. <laughs> I would love to keep it where it is. That's actually worse. Uh... Uh, do I need to rezone? Yes, I do. There's a low density on the outside. Paint. So let's grab our slip road. Get you on the ground as soon as possible because you're heading over to here. And you are going that way, so the traffic should be in separate lanes. Yes, that is bump, bump. So you're going that way, you can get to get the road going that one that way. You're coming out from here. You would very much like to be connected to that. Not that many immediately time soon. You probably can get you. Up to there. Go up, then come back down again. Necessarily have a lot of space here to come around onto this side. Mm. I should really flash green ever so briefly at some blue at some point and don't want to die that far down. That'll work. It's a hell of a day, um, bit of a steep slope, but uh, folks in city skylines are uh, not too fussy about that kind of absurdity. So we'll have you do that. So that lets you get round onto that road. So now if you're coming from this way, then you want to be heading into town. That. You want to get over to that road, don't you? Right. Okay. There. Yep. Yep. That does mean you can go around and turn around. So, ideally, to maintain the turnaround, you need to be able to get from here to there. Well, that's not likely to happen. Hmm. I'm looking at it, I'm not entirely convinced I need to have this road. I mean, it is nice to have the eye shape there. Although, you need to have you dodge quite so much. <laughs> Get away with that. Nope, not quite. And then that. So that's a pretty impressive pair of right turns. So I'll have to wait and see how that pans out. So let's just double check. Going from here, we can go that way and that way. That's fine. Can we make you a double lane? Yes, we can. Uh, 
we're... Oh, okay, I've got this. So if we're coming from here, you can get out and out. If we come from here, you can get out and out. And there's separate roads as well. That's fine. If you are coming from this way, you can go here and in. And here and in. If you're coming from this way, you can go that way. Interesting. I missed something. You need to be able to go from here to there. You can turn around that way. You can turn around that way. Let's just run this again once more time. From here, you can go down this road to go that way. You can go that way to this way. So if we go around to this one, we're going here. You can get up onto there. Can't go that way. So we need to put that hideous malform in, because now you can go there. And then you go that way. I just like this kind of strange roundabout thing we had previously. That way, that way. If you're going from here, you can go both directions. If you're from here, you can go that way, that way. Yeah, okay. You lot sort yourselves out. I forbid them from turning there just yet. Gold root is coming in and turning around. Might as well. Have you stop there? New building. Airport. Yes. Thank you for reminding me, game. Now I know what we're doing next time. So, this looks like it is vaguely working. Interesting. Interesting. I will have a look at my bus routes in the intervening, and I will be back later. Thank you very much for watching this episode of City Skylines, a let's play of the town of Animania, our little megaropolis. Next time we'll be looking at airports and other nefarious things involving flying machines and their landing on the ground. I've been the Mama Set. Please remember to like and subscribe.